You'll see your child's first tooth in the coming months. As a pediatrician, I know how exciting this time can be. However, with this big change comes new approaches to oral health for your baby. The first tooth often enters the mouth around six months of age, but some children develop teeth sooner and some later. The first tooth your baby has is usually the incisor in the front of the lower jaw. As soon as a tooth begins to enter the mouth, it can be at risk for cavities. Dental cavities occur in an acidic mouth environment. The bacteria that live in our mouths produce acid when they feed on carbohydrates. The biggest source of carbohydrates for young babies is milk or formula. The more often that carbohydrates are available for the bacteria to eat, the more often acid is produced. And the more frequently the mouth is acidic, the more likely cavities can occur. Because of this, children should only have milk and formula at mealtimes and never be allowed to sip on milk or other carbohydrate-filled liquids all day long, including fruit juices, even when they're watered down. You might have heard of baby bottle cavities. This condition occurs when a baby is given a bottle at bedtime that has milk or other carbohydrate-filled liquids in it. The milk sits on the teeth all night, providing a continuous food source for bacteria. As a result, the bacteria are constantly producing acid to the point where cavities occur. This creates a situation for severe dental cavities, so babies should never be put to bed with a bottle. So, in summary, make a good practice of limiting the frequency of exposure to carbohydrates for your babies. Only have milk in bottles at meals and never send your child to bed with milk in a bottle.